is in need of a little bit of looking at again. So let's go ahead and just zone this again, leaving the, these roads kind of empty just so that we don't have crazy traffic. And then um, trash is fine there. Community is growing here as well. Let's see, new building. Oh, we have the super fire, or super, yeah, super fire station. Okay, so now this town's gonna grow. It's already growing, and so we'll add some more communities here and we'll bring it up to this line. So now we can make this another major junction coming into the town. Little suburb town, so let's do something like that. There. Oh, it's gonna connect there. Yeah, it'd have to. Whoa, 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 whoa. Curve tool, I, I sometimes hate when I there we go okay so that one looks pretty bad <laughs> but in theory I should be able to get out of this road tool hmm is there an actual yes there it is okay junction so this needs to be stop sign and people coming on this also needs to be stop sign so yeah so people getting off the highway need to stop and let your through traffic go. Um, and then these two lanes don't stop. Yep, that seems about right. Okay, perfect. So people can just keep going there and then this should be nothing. Okay, that's how I want that, perfect. So now we have another main way in and out of the city, um, which will be good for when uh, anyone that needs to get to this or you know, if we make another residential or commercial side here, which is I'm sure is what we're gonna need. And then that's that. So this town's coming uh, along. This kind of looks funky <laughs> here. Um, we'll probably try to do something with it because it just happens to be a little too steep. But, I, oh yeah, and then what I was going to do now since I have that connected. Whoops. Uh, that works. So we'll have a little junction there. Um, hopefully it's not stoplights. No, what is up? This game, it loves its stoplights. Okay, that tool, this junction, let me get out of the road tool, junction, junction, stop sign. So people coming in and out have to stop, but through traffic can constantly keep, what? these people need to stop and have to merge. Yes, there we go. You don't need traffic lights everywhere. Goodness. At least that's how, uh, you know, I've always seen it. There's stop signs before getting on major roads and not um, a bunch of lights. This one might become a little too hectic. We actually might need to put a light. We'll see. We'll see how that one goes. Yeah, that should be a light because that's going to have a lot of through traffic. Um, so see, we're already getting some buildup because of the trucks kind of coming in and out of the, the not the villages, but the, the industrial because this is the only outlet for them. So usually what I like doing is I make a dedicated um, freeway, if you will, just to get them in and out as seamless as possible. So since we have transportation, I think we're going to start early. And let's just make a cargo terminal, right? It's not a train station, but a cargo terminal. But there's a way we want to do this because it gets really congested really quickly. So we'll have them come to the end. And this needs to be a one-way small one way there we go upgrade this so they come this way i hope that doesn't mess up the trucks i'm hoping they can still get in okay so then the one way will lead to the train station hopefully okay and then let's see hmm. oh i know i know what i have to do okay Let's build this here. Yeah, because the trash trucks are having to go all the way around, which makes sense. I guess I could make this a smaller road. Okay, so one way we need cargo station. Let's move it as close. Okay, they're gonna go in. They're going to drop off whatever it is they need. They're gonna come back this way. Oops, no, it needs to be this way. 
Ah, why can't this be on the other side? Let's try putting it on this side. Okay, good. There we go. That's the idea all along. Okay, get out of that. And this. Delete this. So, now, this junction isn't going to be so congested as usual it is. This is going to want to be a stop s <laughs> I want it to be a stop sign, not a stop light. Because this, no one can come down this one-way street, so... Not sure. Also, that's... Oh, did I make this a two-way? Anyways, I'll fix it. Right now, we need to fix this junction. No, they need to stop. No one should be turning left here, so we don't need a light for that. Um, these are one-way streets. This is also a one-way street, so I'm confused why the game thinks you can put a... Make a left. Oh, because you're going to be making a left here? Oh, oh I didn't even think about that. The garbage trucks will be the only one doing that. So we don't need that. Okay, so that will go there. Put a little... Not a turbine right there. We just need... Just one... Connection there. Perfect. And... That's that, right? So that has power. The railroad is down here, so we're gonna make... Ah, see, this is already, like, way off. Ah, now I see why I wanted it there. But that's fine. So we're gonna need a couple of junctions. Um, and this is why I'm kinda wanna use this side. Because we're going to need a junction here that lets incoming trains get to there. And um, outbound trains to get out that way and in that way. And pretty much we just need two... Two... Um, not... We need two triangles is the word I'm looking for. Okay. So, we need to do something like... Not that. I see someone... Some people are joining, so welcome, welcome. We're going to be playing some City Skylines. If I can ever get this to work. Okay. It needs to be on an angle that it still connects, right? Yes, okay. And then same difference here. Let's bring this out. No, no. Curve that way. Mm. Okay, so there we go. So now inbound trains can come in, and trains down this one can go out that way, can go in that way, and go out that way. Okay. Let's see. Let's make this look a bit better. With something like... Yeah, there we go. Okay, now this lets... Let's see, trains come in and trains leave. Um, that should be that. Yep. So actually, momentarily, we'll actually start seeing, yep, yeah, all the trucks come. And so this is why we need one way. So they, they load up there and they come out, I think, this, there you go, same place. But now they're forced to go this way. And since this is a stop sign, then they just get back on the road. So we don't have to cause a bunch of congestion um, when this starts getting really busy and it starts kind of making this big circle. Okay, it doesn't need to be this big, but we can, I just like it, to have plenty of room just so that they, you know, they can do their thing. So, speaking of they, let's make, um, let's see, let's start splitting this up. So, like right here, and then right here. That will be a light, that one's fine. And then let's just try to connect it with the smaller roads, like such. Um, hmm. I wonder if I should do... No, because then it'll start congesting up all the other roads. So usually what I like to do is... I'll pick kind of a couple junctions, and then I do the inverse on the other junctions. So for instance, these ones, you can only get going this way, and but these ones lead out, and this one actually should be the other way, but we just set those up temporarily. So it's fine that they be like that. Okay, so we want that want all of this I believe yeah because that's going to be there okay so that's that now we just got to do the good old give them power give them water power how are we doing for power yep figured we're going to need some more power here in a second um let's just put a couple more wind turbines it shouldn't be yeah the noise is way over here and the homes are over there so we're good there um so that's good 
other than that, I think there's not much we need. Okay. So, oh, this is on fire. That's what I meant to do. I wanted to put their own private fire station right here. He should get power and he should get water. Because, actually, we don't want to connect him to that road. Yes, yes, yes. Because then he has to go through the light. We want the fire station to have a direct line. That one, just there. Perfect. So they'll just be able to go on in and get to the fires because this is like fire prone city here. Speaking of city, we need a few more. So let's go ahead and just get a curved outlet. Let's do it like that. And then we'll bring this back around. Yeah, get as like close to the freeway as possible. And then what we'll do for the freeway is we can build these freeways that have the, the walls just so that these people don't complain about noise pollution. Yep. So <laughs> these walls look really low. <laughs> Um, but the game understands what we're trying to do here. So let's just make both sides this, just in case if it will help. Um, oh, we can make this entire junction all walled. Whoops. <laughs> Careful when placing walls. We need to replace that like that. Okay, and then let's come back that, back under. Like, uh, like that. Like that. Space occupied? Is the junction underneath there? Oh no, the bridge is like practically touching. Oh well, that should be enough. So these the people that are going to be moving in here shouldn't complain too much. Alright, let's go ahead and zone all of this. All of this actually can be zoned. Okay, so let's try to beat them before they complain by just giving this entire outlook that that should then connect and then our power consumption is steadily increasing um, without any kind of stop in mind so let's let's make a service road let's see service road we'll just connect from that junction it's gonna delete that house fine I'll go here and it's gonna go out like you know they need to do maintenance so there's roads so that they can do maintenance. Yeah, that looks fine. And then let's go ahead and we're just going to get a solar panel. There we go. And that should take care of our power for a while because this thing can produce, yeah. It takes a lot of water, but it produces 112 to 160 megawatts. Um, and our consumption is currently 63, but we can produce 152. Uh, so that takes care of that. You never really thought of doing that? I mean, makes it look nice, kind of, sometimes. Oh, that's right. This thing needs a water because it's a steam power plant. There we go. Give them that. So this town should have already moved in. Yep. So that's looking good. I'm, I'm liking this kind of feel. The roads kind of look really funky. And although it, you know, it's triggers a lot of my OCD, like, ah, uh, in some regards and others, I'm like, you know, it looks... I'm okay with it because it looks realistic. So what we're going to do is we're going to need to build another shopping center. So we have this small one up here, but I think we could do with another one over here. Um, we actually can put one maybe in this steep area, but that's not really what I'm having in mind right now. So what we're going to do is we're going to connect this over. And that needs to be a stop lights. Yep. And then we'll make another commercial junction um, kind of in here so that, you know, Little Timmy over here, you know, in this house doesn't have to drive all the way into the center of town to get bread when he can just go over here in this really poorly designed square. <laughs> See, to me, doing square for a commercial doesn't bother me because it's going to need to kind of always be a square because it's just the way they always build. Okay, so there's that. Um, just build like that. Um... Little Timmy can starve. <laughs> oh, that's not very nice. He doesn't need to eat. I beg to differ. Okay, get rid of that, get rid of that, that. And then maybe we'll leave this empty, the main road into here. Uh, just so we don't have to... Oh, look, because we bring out water, perfect. We'll just bring out water there. Power is not going to connect because there's nothing over here. But because of that, power plant's right there, so there's not much to worry about that. 
And all of a sudden, water should be coming in. Oh, we just need to, we need to watch out for our water consumption again. Just make sure it's constant. Okay. And then we can...